What Leonardo da Vinci wanted to tell us was something very basic about the Roman Catholic Church. And he has coded that in his paintings. Is it more likely that a man should be born of a virgin and walk on water and rise from the dead? Or is it more likely that he should have been born as other men are born, married and raised a family? Mary Magdalene is the most important woman in the world history. Not for what she said or did particularly, but because of the reason that the church fathers were so afraid of her image. When Dan Brown makes his suggestion that this great cover-up has gone on, a lot of people get nervous and become instinctively critical of the Da Vinci Code. But the big picture question of how Constantine and subsequent Roman emperors reshaped Christianity to serve their own purpose of political theory for the empire is a powerful and I think largely valid argument. Doubleday published The Da Vinci Code six months ago, and since that moment, I have been asked one question over and over and over. And that is, why does everyone want to talk about this book? And I'd love to say it's about the storytelling and it's about the writing. In all fairness and in all honesty, it probably has a lot more to do with the subject matter.